Good morning, students. Welcome to our class for today. This is Teacher Shai, and welcome to our online class. Okay, so before we start, I would like to ask everyone to please type your English name. Okay, English name, number, and class. All right, so today we are going to talk about what's on TV. Okay, what's on TV? But before that, we will discuss a little bit about adverbs of frequency. Okay, so we will be talking about adverbs of frequency. It's like, how often do you do things? Okay, so we will look at some different types of TV shows. We will know or determine how to use the adverbs of frequency and then answer questions using the adverbs of frequency. Okay, so we will discuss this one first and then TV shows, sentences, activity. All right, so adverbs of frequency. Ah, let's look at what is the meaning of adverbs of frequency. So when we look at here, according to Google Translate, adverbs of frequency is All right, so let's look at here now. So we have some words, okay? We have some of these words that we use for adverbs of frequency, okay? Oh. Okay, so, but in our lesson for today, we only have four, okay? We have four adverbs of frequency. We have always. So always means, as you see, it means 100%, okay? 100%. Usually, usually is like 75%. Sometimes, sometimes. 50% and never 0%, okay? So what are these numbers, okay? What are these numbers? What are those percent? So for example, we have um, this day, uh, these days, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. All right, so if we say always, always, so for example, I will say, I always exercise. Do you know what is exercise? Exercise, exercise, stretch, stretch. Okay, so if I say I always exercise, it means that I exercise from Sunday to Saturday, from Monday to Sunday. Mm -hmm. So I exercise every day. Okay, that means always. I always exercise, it means any every day now for example usually i usually exercise i usually exercise it means i do it at some days like this i exercise on sunday and monday but i do not exercise on tuesday i exercise again on wednesday and thursday but i do not exercise on fridays Okay, so there are some days that I do not exercise. Okay, so that is usually. Okay, when we say usually. Next, sometimes, sometimes. So if I say I sometimes exercise, I sometimes exercise, it means that 50% of the week, okay? 50% of the week, so I don't exercise any. I exercise, no exercise, I exercise, no exercise, I exercise, and no exercise, okay? So it means I sometimes exercise, so like half days of the week, I will exercise or I exercise. And never, okay? As you see, never, my me star, she my, my me draw no star it means zero zero percent i do not exercise okay and any day i never exercise understand yes or no yes okay so always it means you do it always every day 
every day, okay? Usually, 75% um, of the week, 75% of the week, there are some days, excuse me, there are some days that you don't, okay, don't exercise. Sometimes, sometimes it's 50% of the week, Shimai, 50%. 50%. Oh, 50%. This one, 75%. She make her 50% and 100%. What did you say? Me, did you say is cold? Okay, and never is zero percent. Okay, so again, the adverbs of frequency we have. Always, one more time, always, okay? Usually, usually, sometimes, sometimes, never, never, okay? So, uh, example, now, example questions. Now, let's have this action, watch TV, watch TV, okay? So, how often? If you see this word, how often, it means it's asking how many times, okay? Do you watch TV? So how many times in a week, how many times in a day do you watch TV, okay? So if we say, I usually watch TV, I usually watch TV. So I usually, I usually, oh, she watches she watches TV like 75%, she might. Okay. All right, so you could also say, how often do you watch TV? I always watch TV. I always watch TV like um, every day, Monday to Sunday, I watch TV, okay? All right, so let's go on. What shows do you watch on TV, okay? What shows do you watch on TV, okay? So we have eight types, okay? Eight types of TV shows. Now we will talk about more of these um, in your next lesson, but today I will give you an overview, okay? So the first one we have, sports. Sports, okay? So sports, those are like sports shows, okay? Um, live, live sports shown on TV. Okay, again, one more time, sports. Next, cartoons. Cartoons. Okay, so cartoons like Tom and Jerry, like Jake and Finn, she might cartoons. Those are cartoon or cartoons. Next, cooking show. Cooking show. Okay, so from the word itself, cooking. What is cooking? Mm, and then show. So example of a cooking show is Master Chef. Have you watched Master Chef? Yes or no? Yes. No. Okay. Next one is drama. Everybody say drama. Okay, so drama are like shows that is drama, you know, like not real not real it's just a drama oh okay next one is news news okay so news like this one where we watch where we watch what is happening in thailand what is happening in the world okay so again one more time news news okay so next one talk show talk show so from the word itself, talk, okay? The people here just talk. She might just talk about every, about anything. Talk show. Okay, so teachers, I don't know any Thai talk show now. So this is an example of a talk show. Okay, next, sitcom. Sitcom, okay? Sit and then com. Com is actually short for the word comedy, okay? Comedy is a funny show, Shimai. Funny. Comedy it means funny. So example is Mr. Bean. If you watch Mr. Bean and the cartoon Mr. Bean, that is a sitcom as well. 
okay? And documentary. Documentary where they show what is um, happening, okay? Everyday life. What's your everyday life? Like, um, for example, what is happening to the animals? Like that documentary on animals, documentary on anything, okay? They explain or they show um, the daily lives or the daily happenings, okay? Documentary, all right? So we have eight shows again, everybody. Sports, sports. Next, cartoons, cartoons. Next one, cooking show, cooking show. Next one, drama, drama. Next, news, news, talk show, talk show, sitcom, sitcom, documentary, documentary. Okay, so now let's go to our sentences. Okay, so our sentences is the same earlier. So how often do you watch? But this time we have how often do you watch? And then the type of TV show. So how often do you watch? Example, cartoons. How often do you watch cartoons? Okay, so uh, teacher shall use the plural version now because it talks about all the cartoons, like any kind of cartoons, like general cartoons, okay? So how do we answer? How often do you watch cartoons? So in the first blank, we write the adverbs of frequency and then we write, for example, I wrote here cartoon, then we use here cartoons as well. Okay, so example answer, I usually watch cartoons. I usually watch cartoons. Okay, so another example, how often do you watch documentaries? Okay, it means general, general documentaries. How often do you watch documentaries? I sometimes, okay, sometimes, has it, Hasip percent, 50 percent. I sometimes watch documentaries, okay? I sometimes watch documentaries, all right? So again, look at here. Now, teacher, shall I use the plural version of the noun to show that it is the general, okay? General documentaries, like any type of documentaries. Now, I wrote here documentary, Shimai. As I said on the second blank, you also wrote documentaries, documentaries. And here is the adverbs of adverbs of frequency. Okay, again, our adverbs of frequency are always, usually, sometimes, never. No, 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 no. Okay, so activity. Now I need you to write. Okay, how often do you watch these TV shows? How often do you watch cooking shows? How often do you watch dramas? How often do you watch news? Okay, so again, adverbs of frequency, name of the show, type of, type of TV show. Okay, so number one is cooking show. Number two is a drama. And number three is news. Okay, but we can say, how often do you watch cooking shows? How often do you watch dramas? How often do you watch news? Okay, so teacher shall use the plural version, Anina, cooking shows and dramas, because general, like I like a die, I like a die, drama, I like a die, cooking show. Okay, all right, so use this sentence now to answer and write your answers in your notebook. Write your answers in your notebook and send it into our line group or below the below the post okay below this post okay so if you have questions everybody um please ask me in the line group or you can ask your questions in the comments you can tag me so that i can see it immediately Okay, so thank you so much for watching our lesson for today. And I'm sorry if I cannot see you because teacher shy is my sabayan noi. Okay, so 
I hope to see you again next time and see you. Bye, bye, bye.